Back to our top story tonight. A deadly pileup on I-17 in Anthem. Southbound lanes closed for several hours, but they reopened just before 5 o'clock. CBS 5 reporter Sean Klein on the scene with more. We had crashes on both the northbound lane and on the southbound lane. Traffic on the southbound lane just now being reopened after one person did die as a result of one of these wrecks. Here's some video shot from a cell phone earlier today. This is from CBS 5 photographer Sean Gates. He was here on scene shortly after these crashes happened at around 11 o'clock in the morning. Now, according to DPS, the first crash was on the northbound lanes when a car tire blew out and the driver lost control. No one was seriously injured in that car, but the crash did shut down northbound lanes for some time. DPS says the second crash created a six car pileup on the southbound lanes. Those are the other lanes, and that crash killed one driver. We now know that to be a 56 year old Phoenix woman. A DPS spokesperson says this crash was a result of a distracted driver and a case of some rubbernecking. Driving should be the number one thing you pay your attention. You know, when you're on these roads, that should be your number one focus. And too often it isn't. And when it isn't, this is what happens. And there is a woman in life threatening condition right now that's in addition to the one woman who did die. All others involved in that wreck are expected to be okay. And as for the driver of the box truck, which is believed to have caused this wreck, well, he's facing a citation for failure to control. Reporting on I-17 outside Anthem, Sean Klein, CBS 5 News.